Granite and marble specialties. Hello, and welcome to Granite and Marble Specialties video series. In today's episode, we're going to talk about how to clean your counters. It's a very simple process, but we do have some do's and we do have some don'ts. Let me hit on a few don'ts. Please do not use harsh abrasive cleaners, chemical cleaners, 409, Windex, Kaboom. All of these are highly acidic, and every time you use those, you're taking a layer of sealer off the stone. Again, the same thing for lime juice, lemon juice, vinegar. Many people are asking, how do I have a natural cleaner that I can feel good about cleaning my stone, but that will actually work? Well, I have a good solution for you. I'll get to that in just a second. Let's talk about some do's. Do wash your stone every day. Use liquid mild dish soap. Most of us should have this in your house. And a rag. Very simple, a few drops of your soap, get it nice and wet with some very hot water, and just wipe down your counters. That'll help save a buildup of residue over time. Very simple. Do use cutting boards. Let's save your knives. Do use coasters. So if you're sitting down, you're having a drink with a friend, treat it just like wood, but it's much more beautiful. Very simple, small steps like this will, will keep your stone beautiful for a long time. Let me share a little secret with you. Now, this product, most of us should have in our homes. Isopropyl alcohol. It's very inexpensive. If you don't have some, go to your, your nearest grocery store, your nearest pharmacy. Anyone will have it. This is your friend. What you're going to do, take your trusty spray bottle, you're going to fill it about halfway with alcohol and the other half with the water. And that dilutes it enough that this will clean your counters, but it will also leave a gorgeous shine. Now, one of the other benefits of this is it's going to disinfect your countertops. So what we're going to do, spray down your countertops very liberally, make sure everything's covered, and then I want you to wait three to five minutes. During that time, the alcohol is going to kill all the bacteria and it's going to disinfect the counters. And today more than ever, we all want that for our families and we want our homes to be a little safer. So I think you're going to love that. But a beautiful byproduct of that is after the three to five minutes, come back, dry rag, give it a nice, good spin, put a little elbow grease in it. Don't be afraid to turn over your towel. A little bit of buffing here. And when you're done, not only do you have a clean counter, you have a beautiful countertop. This is going to be as shiny as the day it was put in. It's a fantastic way to bring back the shine and luster that we may have lost over time. Let me speak one more thing real quick. You may run your hand across a stone and you may feel little bumps and pockets. Well, those are buildups of dirt and grime and different things that hit our countertops every day. So from time to time, you're going to want to use a razor blade. Simple, very inexpensive straight razor blade, but make sure you have granite first. Granite will not scratch as long as this razor blade is flat to the stone. So run it all over the stone, everywhere, and when you're done, you're going to look at this and go, wow, where did that come from? Very normal. So again, once in a while, you be the judge, but you're going to want to keep a few of these around. They'll be your best friend. Well, there you have it, my friends. Nothing too complicated. I promise you'll love this, and it'll take good care of you for a long time to come. If you have any questions, go ahead and email us at granitemarblewa.com, and we can answer any questions you might have. And until the next time, enjoy your stone. Thanks for watching.